Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you are a medical student aiming to practice medicine in the United States, you have probably heard of the USMLE, the United States Medical Licensing Examination. In today's video, we will be breaking down the steps involved in this crucial exam. So let's dive right in. The USMLE consists of three steps, step one, step two, and step three. Each step tests your capabilities as a doctor or a different scale. First up, let's talk about USMLE step one. Step one is all about the basics of medical science. It tests your understanding and application of key concepts in areas like anatomy, biochemistry, microbiology, pathology, pharmacology, and physiology. Here are the key details you need to know about step one. Number one, it's a one day examination. Number two, it consists of multiple choice questions. Number three, the exam is divided into seven 60 minutes blocks with a total of 280 questions. Number four, the focus is on your ability to apply scientific principles to clinical scenarios. Next, we have USMLE step two, which is divided into two parts again clinical knowledge CK and OED. Step 2 CK assesses your medical knowledge and understanding of clinical science necessary for patient care. It includes subjects like internal medicine, surgery, pediatrics, psychiatry and obstetrics and gynecology. Here are the key details for Step 2 CK. Number 1. It's also a one-day examination conducted in a 9-hour session. Number 2. It consists of multiple choice questions. Number 3. The exam is divided into 8 60-minute blocks totaling around 318 questions. Number 4. It emphasizes patient management and clinical problem solving. OET exam. Finally, let's talk about USMLE Step 3 the last hurdle before you can become a licensed physician in the United States. After completing USMLE Step 1 and 2, you can take the Step 3. Step 3 checks whether you can apply medical knowledge and understanding of biomedical and clinical science essential for the unsupervised practice of medicine. It is a two-day examination. Day 1 of Step 3, also known as Foundations of Independent Practice, FIP. It includes approximately 232 multiple choice questions. It covers basic medical and scientific principles necessary for effective healthcare delivery. Day 2 of Step 3, known as Advanced Clinical Medicine, ACM. It includes approximately 180 multiple choice questions. It features 13 computer based case simulations. And third, it tests your ability to manage patients in an ambulatory setting. And that's a wrap. While this might feel like a long and tiresome process, the results are totally worth it. Not to mention, you get paid for during your residency period as well, which means you can start earning right after your USMLE Step 1 and Step 2. With the right guidance and support, you can clear all these steps and get registered in the USA living a life of your dreams. Get in touch with Academically to know about our USMLE preparation course or book a free 101 counseling session with our experts by filling up the form in the description. You can also learn about the other exams for doctors such as AMC, PLAB, DHA, etc. Thank you for watching this video. We hope you got all the information you were looking for. We will soon be back with another video for doctors. Till then, goodbye.